Yo, 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 guys, it's your boy Dyer here. Gonna show you guys the Psycho Clown trial fight. I already finished everything earlier on my first run. So I'm gonna go ahead and show y'all how I did it. Um, the friend unit, pretty important. I, uh, I brought an olive last time. Um, but you can also bring I would prefer to bring some someone with no uh, no elemental weapons for this specific, if you're trying to go for everything in one run let me see what he's got that's the problem it's hard to tell like who's got you know non elemental weapon let's see I'm pretty sure everybody's going to have. Everybody's going to have Excalibur. Something. Let me see. Noctis is really... He's really great for this because All right, good. This guy's got it set up. We're going to go ahead and use this Noctis. Cuz he has elemental, he can add. He has a 3, you know, fire, lightning, ice, and he can add to his attacks when that element comes up. So I'm using Garnet for the build the limit burst gauge. I'll show you what her gear is. I got four ignorance to build the gauge really quick. I just kind of upped her elemental resistance with the rainbow robe and the soul crown. Give her some spirit to kind of help with the magic. Um, this boosts her dark, or it boosts dark element. So I went ahead and did that. It gives you 50 and then I gave her a Regan ring White Knight Noel. Just have him geared with H plus HP plus defense. Refia, giving her uh you want to at least have five thousand HP, give her vested in the mind for refresh. And I hit her up with the shards of genius and dual cast. Marie. Hit her up with some auto some auto refresh. Give, make sure she had 5,000 HP. Some Shard of Genius. And, you know, this is what she's looking at with her elemental resistances. That's going to keep her alive the longest. And then Noctis. Non elemental. Gave him Discernment and Man Eater. Going to keep his H. You, you know, you want to be able to just chip away to build that limit gauge because you want to have that ready for the end. Once you build up your limit gauge and you summon those espers, you're good to go. Alright, so let's go ahead and get up in there. <clears throat> Just gonna go ahead and do all this. Alright, cool. So, what we're going to do is Garnet. We're just going to go ahead and uh, defend with her. We want to keep her alive. Marie's going to do I Love You All. We'll have Migs use Cover for MP. White Knight Noel is going to use Bring It On. And then... Ch -ch 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 -ch. Refia can go ahead and uh, get some uh, Kiraja going.
And then we're just gonna go ahead and uh, attack to get those, build those limit crystals up. All right, so. Garnet. I'm gonna go ahead and bang this out to bring the limit gauge up, or the Esper gauge. Marie's job for the second turn is gonna be Protectga and Shelga. That's very important. So you tend to, what I'll do is the first turn, I'll, I love you all, second turn I'll do that. White Knight Noel can, you can either use steel or you can just attack to kind of build some limit crystals. Just keep everybody healed with Refia. And just drop some attacks in there for the limit crystals. Because Noctis' limit burst takes a long time to max out. And you want to be able to finish him off with a limit burst. Go ahead and do that. Now we can summon Carbuncle. Before you do that, you want to get your heals in. Ahead and drop steel for damage mitigation. We'll refresh cover. You want to keep cover up. Some sort of MP re refresh is very important. Now we can drop Carbuncle. That, that that takes care of half of that. Next is this Diablos. Then you just hit hit him up with an attack. Some limit burst crystals. And we got a little bit of protection next round with the reflect. Perfect, because that would have that would have sucked anyways. There's no way to resist Graviga since they made it non-elemental. All right, let's refresh. Uh, bring it on. We're gonna refresh. Love you all. Defend with Garnet. And what we'll do here, we're gonna dual cast Asuna on that Noctis and Kiraja. So make sure everybody's at full HP. And we're just gonna drop some attacks for the limit crystals. White Knight Noel can use Steel. Guardian's Oath. Maria will do her Protect and Shell again. Pretty much it's, it's gonna be a repeat of uh, with Marie. You're gonna use Love You All, Protect Ga, Shell Ga. Then you can do something else on the third turn, whether she needs a backup heal or use her, her limit burst, which is a double reflect. You get two reflex when it's at max. We're gonna refresh, cover. And then uh, we'll just dual cast Kiraja. Actually, what we'll do is Kiraja and Asuna. On Marie. Get that poison off of her. And then do some attacks with Noctis. Oh, 
Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and just pop steel with White Knight Noel. Now here's the same thing. You're gonna you just bring it on and then you have two turns to do something and then bring it on again. I like to just rotate in three turns. Garnett will defend. We're gonna go ahead and do a dual cast. Asuna on Refia and then Kiraja. Get that poison off of her. Now with Murray, it's really better just to defend this time around. We don't need her to heal anything and then we'll just attack with these two for some limit crystals. <clears throat> Alright, so now we'll do Guardian's Oath. Now we're going to use our Diablo summon. Get that out of the way. And at that point, we don't even need Garnet now. Once she dies, you know, we'll just leave her down. Um, White Knight Noel, we'll use Bring It On. Refi is going to go ahead and dual cast. We don't even need that. Just Kiraja. Marie's going to use Love You All. And then we're just going to... I'm just going to refresh uh, cover. Alright, so he controlled White Knight Noel, which is fine. He's the tank anyways. So... We'll refresh our Protectga Shelga. Rafia, go ahead and dual cast Asuna and herself. Kiraja. I'm gonna go ahead and drop some attacks with these two. We'll go ahead and drop some attacks with her too. Guardian's Oath, at least make use of that. Alright, so now, dual cast. We want to get blind off of that Noctis, and then we'll Kiraja. Marie, what can you do this time around? Really nothing. We're just going to defend with her and drop some attacks. Once you get that rhythm going, you know, it's pretty much, well, this, this is where, it, you know, he'll do this once every couple turns after he's done going through his gambit. So we survived it, which is fine. We're going to go ahead and pop love you all. Rafi is going to go ahead and do her dual cast, Kiraja. We'll get our MP refresh going. And bring it on with White Knight Noel. And then some attacks with Noctis.
All right, Marie. Send the re up the protect in the shell. <clears throat> Steel. Uh, we'll dual cast Asuna, Marie, and Kiraja. And then we're just going to drop some attacks with these two. You will remember, anytime you're going to apply Reflect. You definitely want to use your cures first, so they don't bounce back and hit the boss. Because that can happen. <clears throat> so... Go ahead and do that. Asuna. Raja. Get that done. Marie can pop Ruby Light. We'll use cover. And then we'll just drop some attacks with these two. Back at it again. Love you all. We'll do a dual cast. Kiraja. And then Isuna. Bring it on. And some attacks. Once you get your maxed out limit gauge, then you can really start working them over with the two, with your two Noctis or your two D, DPS, whatever they may be. Asuna, Kiraja, get that done, and drop a couple of attacks. Because Noctis' limit burst is just so slow. Even with a maxed out limit burst, he, he goes slow. Hold on a second. Okay, so... We want to take blind off of the other Noctis. We'll do that. And we're going to go ahead and uh, we're going to reapply cover. And now I'm going to use. Marie's Magical Prism to give you a double reflect. And at this point, go ahead and uh, bring it on and then attack.
All right, cool. Now, we're almost at a max limit, but we're gonna go back to the I love you all. Light Knight Noel can use steel. that but I'm afraid uh, might be the bad time so we're just gonna use Kiraja and Asuna all right we'll just drop some attacks all right so I my Noctis is at maxed out now. Now we can actually start hooking them up. He's weak to lightning this round, so it's a perfect time. Dual cast, protect uh, Shelga. Go ahead and get that dual cast. Kiraja. Go ahead and do some Thunder Flask. Hold on a second, guys. All right, so we got double thunder flask. Now he's gonna probably hit a threshold there. We survived, which is good. Go ahead and dual pat cast Kiraja. attack get some limit crystals I still need the other Noctis and I'm just gonna attack with you too all right so did some serious damage there, but we're gonna dual cast Kiraja. Love you all. He's weak to light this round, so I'm just gonna pop steel. Now we'll just attack with these two. Hopefully he survives. Me with that Ultima. All right, good deal. All right, so he didn't he didn't do his typical move this time around. Dual cast Protectica and Shelga. Cures up in here. Reapply cover. Steel. 
and then attack. Okay. Kiraja. Here, attack. I need to get that last limit burst filled up. <laughs> so, we'll attack there. There we go. Alright, cool. We'll just drop some attacks now until he's weak to either fire. Um, I can't tell if, if he's weak to lightning because of Marie or because of his buff, so that's why I didn't. I didn't do anything that round, but weak to fire, ice, or lightning, and then you can give it a go. And, uh, just to drop a Raja, make sure we're all at full HP. And we we'll just hit those attacks. Actually, I can actually start using Warp Break. Don't know what I'm really doing there. Alright, so he's weak to ice. Blizzard Flask. <clears throat> All right. on this is one of those rounds where he's he has no weakness just reapply cover go ahead and drop Marie's reflect when it burst Obviously, it uh, can't be reflected back, which kind of sucks this round. Because it didn't take away the reflect, which kind of... to do some stupid I can't do anything right now because Ultima didn't get reflected and if I heal it's going to heal up Kafka so to just defend help to survive
Alright, so it worked out. You just gotta be careful when you do that because at that threshold it didn't really help much. Reapply cover. Just defend with Marie. Do a dual cast, the Suna, the Kiraja. Steel. Shouldn't kill him. Just want to time it so when you use those limit bursts, you get that last achievement. Dual cast, protect the shell go. Asuna, Kiraja. It was that Thunder Flask. Just want to keep it close, you know. I don't want to I don't want to kill him yet. Graviga is the only thing that stinks. Reapply what you can.
take that blind away now. Defan with White Knight. Get our Protect Shelga going on. Survive that Ultima. Let's re up on the heels. And then bring it on. Finish him off. Let's see. Throw the armager there just in case. Yeah, he's on that he's on that weird shit, so. Oh my god. Well, I just screwed up last minute there. He had that crazy defense drop. I could have just used Armager then. That would have did it. But you see the, the strategy, so it's essentially all I had to do was just use Armager at that last attack, and it would have uh, it would have killed him because his defense was dropped, and then you would have got the limit burst. So, sorry it wasn't a perfect run, but at least uh, it's done. So anyways guys, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. Um, at 5,000 followers, I'll be doing another giveaway. So, keep them out for Harambe and your boy Dyer's out.